big vibe again. So today we're making a sorrel drink. Uh, so sorrel is the hibiscus plant. In uh, Ghana, they call it sobolo. So today we're making sorrel drink slash we're making sobolo slash we're bringing a vibe. Today we're bringing a vibe to the Jamaican sorrel drink. So we're gonna take it way back and we're gonna make a vibe. So I already make my sorrel drink. As you can see right here, this is how we make it. So you take sorrel, which is the hibiscus plant, which in Ghana, they call it sobolo, and you boil it. So you boil it, so you wash it thoroughly, because there's dirt, it's a plant. So you wash it thoroughly, uh, thoroughly, not thoroughly. So you wash it, and then you get some cinnamon sticks, some cloves, uh, I put pineapple skins in there, and you just boil that, let it reduce, cool it down, and now we're gonna put the vibe to the sorrel drink. So, big, big vibe, Crazy Chef. If you like the vibe, hit that like button. If you wanna be a part of the vibe, hit that red subscribe button. Sorrel drink, sober low, whatever you wanna call it, whether you live in America, you live in Jamaica, or you live in Ghana, or Africa. This is the drink for you. This is Sorrel Drink Sober Low with a vibe. Crazy Chef, big, big vibe. Let's get into the video. So that's all we're doing is we're just juicing our apples because that's a big part of the vibe. And uh, it's Christmas time, so if you haven't checked out my food cake recipe. I got two of them on there. I'm gonna put a link in the description below. You can go check those out. I got two awesome food cake, Jamaican food cake recipe slash the Jamaican black cake, whatever you wanna call it. I got two awesome recipes on there. Plus, I got the Mary Lou box cake on there. Plus, just for a vibe, I got, like if you didn't soak your fruits all year, I got a way on there where you can get your fruit nice, you know, with the rum, the wine, and it's not tough. So, check it out. I'm gonna put a link in the description below. You can go check that out. But today we're working on a different type of vibe. Today we're working on the sorrel drink. So, a lot of people like sorrel. But it's a very, it's a very strong drink. So I'm gonna mellow it out. I'm gonna mellow it out just for a vibe. So just for a vibe, we're gonna mellow the sorrel out. Let's take, let's take these out because we're gonna need this bowl. So I'm gonna wash this bowl. Just so. Because what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take, I'm gonna, let, let me take this one. I'm gonna take my apple juice and I'll just pour it in there. There we go. Just so we can get the rest of our apple. So put our juice back on, apple goes in, and we'll get the rest of the juice. But as I said, this sorrel drink is a guaranteed vibe. Guaranteed vibe. And the good thing is about this drink, you don't put a lot of sugar. It's more healthier than the other one. That's it. So that's all our So now we're gonna take this pineapple and we're gonna cut it. We're gonna take this one off and we'll just we'll just save it right there. Then we're gonna take this off. We'll save that. So this skin you wouldn't throw it out, you'd save it. Because that's what you'd use. So, so you use this skin to boil with your hibiscus leaf or your sorin. And that's what's gonna give you that vibe. So 
we take so you naturally you'd save these you'd save these skins so naturally as I said you'd save these but we're not gonna need those because we already set that so all you gotta do now is take your pineapple and make wedges just like that and if you don't have a juicer if you don't have a juicer just use your blender or your Robocoop whatever you have so this is I have a then I'm gonna take this ginger this ginger I have washed it and cleaned it so it's pretty good so I'm gonna take the juice from the ginger and as I said if you don't have a juicer just use a blender or you can just grate it and boil it with the soil and you get that vibe just the same but I got this awesome juicer so I just like to run things through my juicer it's better our ginger so now we're gonna add this to the vibe and then we're gonna strain or sorry and we're gonna add our lemon we're gonna add all the fun stuff now so stick around for the rest of the video let's get to that vibe so now we're gonna add our pineapple juice and our ginger mixture stir that in we're gonna add some red label wine and just stir that in then we're gonna add some liquid sugar otherwise called simple syrup and we throw that in there and now a very important part that makes it a Jamaican vibe is you have to add some Ray and Nephew rum. Not too much, just a bunch. And you throw that in there depending on your liking and taste. And so now we're going to change the vibe we're gonna change the vibe right now the vibe's gonna just go crazy right now because right now is where we add or sorrel otherwise called so if you're in ghana you'd say you add your subaru because i'm jamaican i said i add the sorrel and this i boiled maybe a month ago so this has been soaking for a long time and as I said, I told you how I boiled it. Cinnamon stick, cloves, some ginger, and a little bit of vanilla, a little bit of rose water. And I also put a little bit of salt. I like to put salt. So I'll just give you that balance. And now, if you look now, now you got that vibe. Like, now, if you can smell it right now, like you'll say, you'll realize that now this part of the vibe is where I add my lime and these limes are seedless don't, don't worry there's no seeds in them so this part of the vibe I add my lime and you don't need too much you just need a little bit for flavor so I add my lime and I add my lemon Lemon has a couple seeds, so I do like this so I can catch the seed. So, at this part, as I said, I add my lime and my lemon. And because that's a big part of the vibe, you want to give it that extra kick for flavor. So, I added my lime and my lemon, and all I do is I just slowly take my glove off, and it takes all the seeds and the take this guy off also and get rid of my track 
and I'm not a big sorrel person so I don't like it's too strong so this just gives you a better better vibe so let's give it a test let's give it I'll give it a small test just to see as always I like to know if it's a vibe myself before I present the vibe so oh so good oh so mellow and nice so good so as I said big big vibe big big vibe so I'm gonna put a spin on it as usual and I'll see you in the intro crazy chef big vibe Saril drink Zubaloo if you're in Ghana crazy chef upgraded vibe <laughs> yeah so this is my upgraded vibe for the Saril big vibe crazy chef like share subscribe so good. 